Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to EU4 and the Rise of the Philippine Tiger campaign. So, last episode, well, actually the last couple of episodes, I believe, we've kind of just been stabilizing uh, our mass possess or our uh, possessions in Sumatra that we took in pretty short order. But, uh, yeah, you know, we're getting pretty close to the end of that. We're drowning in money, 13 ducats a month. So, this episode, we're going to be going after Majapahit and claiming this last center of trade in the Malacca's trade node. And then we're also going to be colonizing the Andamans. I know we need these two. We need Sampit and uh, Katapang for the achievement, but I do want to get the Andamans so that we can get up to uh, Pegu because Pegu's allies are really weak right now. Just Arakan and Langshang, and they're both super weak. So that would be pretty easy. We could even annex Arakan in that war, which would be quite nice, giving us a bit of a jump here. It will, well, it'd allow us to skip Ming, basically. Oh, I'm still not pleased about this. Why, why Ming? Why? Oh, well. But after uh, we take this state from Majapahit, we're going to go ahead and kill off Malacca. And then I was looking at uh, the ledger, and we can just absolutely demolish Aya right now. We have twice his force limit. Well, not quite twice his... Well, I think we actually do have twice his force limit, pretty much. But we have twice as many men raised right now, and we're almost at maximum manpower. That being said, we may have to delay some of these things a little bit because of printing press. I do want to just dev bomb uh, Bugloss as quickly as possible to get up to printing press. And then that's going to be the last institution we really have to dev bomb for. So, uh, yeah, you know what? Let's just get right into it. Resuming exactly where we left off, Banka is very close to being finished, and like I said, we're going to go to the Andamans after that. Uh, oh, yes. So our current uh, ruler was withdrawn in contemplation. Right now, he is a 2-3-4. Wait for it. And now we check. He is a 3-4-4 now. Hmm. The, uh, and that is one of the my favorite things about the Hindu religion, is the fact that you can... Uh, Take those withdrawn in contemplation events for your ruler to improve some of their stats. It, it's amazing. So let's go ahead and move uh, one of our armies down there. Who's in charge here? Uh, I think that was one of our state generals, actually. All right, Owen Morrison, you get down to uh, Benkulu. And let's see. We're going to need the navy for this more than likely. So we'll go ahead. Oh, we lost claims on Surabaya. No. Do we have claims anymore? Oh, please don't tell me we just lost our claims. What do I have claimed? Demok. Uh, you know what? I think it's actually fine. We don't really need to worry about getting a spy network on him. Uh, we still have the truce with Malacca, so I would like to get more um, claims on him. Let's see, what is his next highest development province? Probably, yeah, we're going to get... Uh, we have a claim here on Patani. Let's get a claim on Parak. Yeah, I think that'll be fine. So what are these three ships? These, these are transports. You guys can go over to Banka. That's fine. We are taking a little bit of attrition for this, but it's not the end of the world. Our Monarch Point generation is now better than it was, which is fantastic. We have a uh, 987. Let's go ahead and pay that loan off. What can we build? Um, You know what? We could go ahead and build the uh, Temple in Bugloss. That's actually quite tempting. Let's go ahead and do that. That's an extra point. Uh, two, four ducats a month, which is lovely stuff. There we go. Banka is uh, self-sustaining. We do have to core it. There goes 35 admin that we could have used to dev bomb. Um, what, what, what game? What? Oh, advisor died. No, our discipline advisor. Uh, I guess we'll hire the manpower guy. You know what? No, actually, we're gonna save up and probably. Yeah, you know, for now we're just gonna hire the manpower guy. I'm gonna stop talking. <laughs> um, oh. We're going to take the prestige hit. I don't like doing it before, right before we go to a war. Or go to war, excuse me. But I don't think it's going to be that much of an issue. So let's just go ahead and declare on Majapahit right now. Since we will be fighting this war, um, it is going to... We are going to allow some monarch points to accrue during this period. Absolutely obliterated the Majapahit navy. Let's go ahead and... Uh, do you have forts? Let's find out. Uh, that is not the province that, or the map mode I want to see. Oh. Oh, they have no forts. 
They have no forts, never mind. We're just gonna basically carpet siege once we beat them down. Okay, colonists, while I am thinking about it, get up to the Andamans. Uh, we'll send this 2k stack up there. There we go, that's fine. There's only 500 natives in uh, the Andamans, but still, it's the principle of the matter. Alright, so we are splitting up a bit, but I'm pretty sure Maja Pahit can't even really muster a fight at this point compared to us. Uh, yes. Oh, oh no. Influenza. Yeah, we're quarantining the province. I will not allow influenza to spread. That is uh, pretty rough. All right, Ming, whatever. Take take your stuff. It's, get, it's going to be very soon. Very soon, Ming. Um, okay. What's your tech? 11. Uh, we have tech 12. Tech 12 is pretty important, if I remember correctly. I think we should... Uh, oh, my one stack got annihilated. All right, let's watch this battle. We have 4.2 morale, 1.7 tactics. Goodbye. Goodbye, Maja Pahit. Goodbye. You tried. I'm going to chase that army down, actually. We have plenty of manpower now, so it is uh, all good. Let's go ahead and get our navy over here to kind of blockade some things. There is the full Maja Pahit Navy. I'm going to send this 22 stack to go finish off the Maja Pahit Army. Shouldn't be too much of an issue. Uh, ooh, okay. Was that a general? General with 40... What? Are you new? You're new, I think. Is this guy new? Or is this guy new? I don't know. This guy sucks, but... um, 1262? Two, what? Where did you come from? What madness is this? Where did you come from, sir? All right, there we go. And Maja P is dead. Lovely stuff. That was fast. Since we're not actually going to be taking too much from him, I think we can go ahead and make our peace. Uh, no, we have to finish occupying Surabaya. That is a lot of war score. All right, Surabaya is down. Uh, let's see. We'll throw these two ships out into the fray as well. Let's see what happens here. We don't have an admiral, but... Oh, we don't actually have the heavy ship advantage either. I think we might have the... Uh, yeah, I think we actually do have a Diplotech lead on, and we've lost two of ours. Um, let's see. So they want peace. I guess we go ahead and make peace. <laughs> this will get a coalition. Yeah, Malaka, Majapahit, that's fine. 69 war score, 270 admin to core. Which we don't actually have. Um, that's fine. We'll just take 400 ducats as well. Uh, I would like that 400 ducats. I mean, this is fine, I guess. We'll just retreat and save our fleet. We did take some pretty massive casualties there. He's on Diplotech 12. That actually kind of makes sense. Let's look at Diplotech, shall we? Yeah, that's why. That's why. Oh, well. Not the end of the world. Go kill that one stack. It's over. Okay, now it's over. Now you give me this, you give me all of your money. And, uh, yeah, that's fine. Done. There we go. And that is the last of the achieve the land we actually need in this area for our achievement. Minus the uncolonized provinces, obviously. Now we do have to core it, is the thing. So let's start with the most expensive ones. Uh, yeah. And now we're out of admin. Let's go ahead and drop 100 military points into Bugloss. That'll give us another 5 or so percent towards printing press, which is nice. Yeah, we, we lost a lot of ships. I'm not pleased. Oh, well, not the end of the world. Rebel Uprising in Keda. That's actually not surprising either. Let's go ahead and head to uh, Parowak. I believe is how you'd say that. We'll bring the uh, Navy up. Uh, rise, uprising in the Andamans, that's fine. 631, two pos the third. Yes, excellent. I mean, he's not great. He's got one mil, one in mil, which is not great by any means, but six admin, and that is awesome. I, I am very pleased with that six admin. And since we're a Hindu nation, we can probably get him to withdraw into contemplation to improve that even further. So we're going to leave this army down here in the area to deal with na or, uh, rebels that we will be facing here. Yeah, this is going to cost quite a bit to core. But 
You know what? It's fine. Let's go ahead and get Ko uh, Kowali started. And then we'll just kind of work our way up from the bottom there. All right, so then the army's here. Go take the uh, army and the fleet are here. Go over to Keta. Drop them off. So we're probably going to have an uprising, which is more than okay with me. Speak of the devil and it shall appear. Uh, Ming just wants money from us now. That I am totally fine with. Uh, Vigi has insulted us. Uh, that's not fun. Okay, so let's check. I saw, like, a couple of things pop up. We got Entrepreneur. Yes, another 10% trade efficiency. That is amazing. All right, so let's build manufacturing, shall we? Um, our best one is going to be down in Pontianak, so I'm okay with that. Let's get that built. Pontianak is a pretty sweet province. Pretty sweet at 16 dev. And that was a colonizable province, too. That's the best thing about that. So it was basically free land. All right, we're going to have some Majapahit separatists, which I'm fine with. Sulu separatists, I highly doubt. There's some prestige from getting Parawak converted. Uh, let's go ahead and start with Linga, I guess. Uh, where is Linga, actually? I need to check that. Where? Where? Where is this place? Uh, am I just blind? Ah, here it is. That's fine. Do we have... Uh, this is not a state, so we can't uh, turn on the missionary strength edict. But I think that'll be okay. We'll still convert pretty quickly as it is. Uh, that's still on protect trade. This is converted. This is converted. Alright, so we need to really focus our efforts of conversion there. We can get another age ability, so let's do that. Um, Should we pick up... Yeah, I think we will pick up the institution spread through uh, True Faith provinces, because we pretty much have everything converted to Hindu at this point. For the most part, anyway. Alright, so our truce should be up. Yeah, our truce is up with Malacca. But we still need to uh, at least start everything here coring. So we'll have to work on that. Okay, estates. Some estate things expired. The burgers are super unhappy, and I don't like that, because we're making way less money than we should be right now. Um, back to converting. We're gonna go to Banka, I guess. Yeah, we just uh, converted, or we just finished this. So let's enforce religious unity to speed that up a little bit. Ooh, Majapahit is having pretender rebels. That is, uh, I guess, good for us. I mean, they're gonna die. Majapahit is basically a dead nation at this point. So where are our spies? Uh, we're still improving with Ming for the time being. Let's get a spy network in Pegu. What is this war? Ooh, Arissa. Oh, Ming is going into Smashdown. Oh, Ming, no. Please don't take that land. Please, no, Ming. Don't do this to me. Ming, I swear to God. I swear to God, Ming. <laughs> do, don't do this to me, man. Don't, just don't. Just don't be like that. Oh, God. Now, now I'm suddenly, like, just irritated. Well, Ajuran had the Ulima seize power. That's uh, amusing. Some mismanagement there. Uh, let's see here. We actually have slipped down below 25 power projection. Who are we rivaling? Just Vigi. That's fine. So we're going to send an insult to Vigi. Uh, v yeah, Vigi. Or Vijay, however you prefer to say it. Uh, give me admin. Thank you. Let's go ahead and send an insult. Yep, back up to 29 power projection. Lovely stuff. So everything is now coring, which is awesome. So once that gets cored, our uh, trade income will definitely be increasing. Uh, Andamans have gone there. That's fine. Back to Boogloss. We can do some more dev bombing here. Four and a half uh, from printing press and 4.6 now. Should be up to, yeah, 65. That's pretty good. So we're getting there. We are going to be falling a little behind in tech and ideas due to dev bombing, but we will have the institution very quickly, which I am quite happy with. So we won't have that mat or that tech penalty for too long in general. Okay, uh, we've lost the diplomatic insult CB against Vijay. I don't care. That's fine. So yeah, we're really just waiting on the cores at this point. Um, I think I will go ahead and burn some more admin here. Because we real I oh, I just want to get this done at this point. Majapahit Separatists definitely are going to fire. Uh, 27k, I'm not super concerned. Um, I'm pretty sure the 24 stack down there can handle it. Or the 23 stack, excuse me. 
Let's go ahead and add another infantry, actually. Alright, well, it looks like Majapahit is dealing with their pretender rebels quite quickly. Or rather handily, I should say. Uh, let's see. I don't really want to build anything else right now. Is there anything else we really need to build? Is the question. Um, this actually would get a lot of trade power. Why? I think the burgers own it. Yeah, merchant guilds own it. That's fine. That's fine. We'll just leave it be for now. No real reason to mess with it. All right, so they fired in Kalapa, which is fine. We should be able to handle them pretty easily. Yep. We did take a lot of casualties, but uh, we have plenty of manpower to spare at this point. But no, you go back there. Yeah, that cost us 9k manpower, but I think we're absolutely fine. Yeah, I'm... F okay, now that Ming is taking money, I'm actually quite pleased uh, by that. Yes, I'm actually quite pleased by the fact that Ming is just taking money. Um, you know, building a... Eh. Ah, I want to build a courthouse here, but, I mean, that's our capital, so the autonomy is already super low. Another uh, 30% and... 30% support for printing press, and we'll have that. Sireborn is cord. Lovely stuff. I would like to make this a state. I really would like to make this a state, but we don't have any more states, actually. Once we get to Admin Tech 12, we will. But, uh, not until then. Uh, oh, hey, two base, two free production in Sulu. Thank you, game. Not even mad in the slightest about that. So I think uh, Sulu is going to be one of the next provinces we convert because it is in one of our states and it is uh, 15 dev, which is pretty nice actually. It is a not a an unsubstantial amount of development by any means. So production wise, really not a lot to be gained from these two buildings right now. Uh, barracks, yep. Let's build a barracks in Bugloss. That'll get us even more manpower. Uh, let's start, okay, let's see, settlement of political refugees, 10 legitimacy, do we need legitimacy? Dev cost production efficiency, sure, yes please, basically, <laughs> uh, we'll go like that, we'll go like that, and then we have to wait one more month to get another point of development, uh, where's Palawan? Oh, speak of the devil, it's right there, um, do, do, do I Yes, I can train. I guess we can take the uh, full army over to Palawan. That's fine. All right, so everything is now cored. Lovely, lovely stuff. Andamans is fish. Meh. Um, let's see here. I'm not. No. Uh, you know what? The clergy can be pissed. I don't really care because have money and go away. Okay, so our power projection is really low right now. Hmm, I think we need to embargo Vigi. Uh, we are embargoing him. Damn. Uh, do we have any more valid rivals? No, we're just too big. Uh, how much dev do we have? 650, or 752. Damn. That is crazy. Alright, there we go. Peasants are fine. Bank is converted, giving us a little extra prestige. Alright, let's get Sulu. Palawan is a state, right? Yes, it is a state. So let's get the missionary strength up and on the go. Over to Sulu and convert. Actually, I want the arm. I want uh, this fleet. I want this army to be in Sulu now. Once again, we can build buildings. Was that a. Oh, wow. 25 ducats a month. Woo! Oh, baby. Oh, baby. That is insane. We need to rebuild our navy. Which is fine. I'm not opposed to it. I would like to build some shipyards at some point to be able to crank these heavies out. Well, I mean, we can actually crank heavies out pretty easily through here. There we go. An extra a little more prestige for converting Linka. So what's next on the agenda? Delhi, go. We have a free uh, diplomat, which is fine. Let's get that claim on Pegu. Uh, Pegu, has, Pegu is 31 dev. That's amazing. I want it. You will give it to me. Thank you. Okay, so Arakan, we're going to have to fight to bet. Uh, Arakan grew a little bit, actually. That's fine. Okay, Ming, you can have... Wait, Ming, you're making me take a loan. Uh, no, actually, we won't be taking a loan because we make 27 ducats a month, so we'll go back into the positive almost immediately. 
That's great. We should hire some more advisors or some higher level advisors to kind of help counteract the absolute monarch point. Uh, the death of... I, you know what? I, what was I going to... Uh, We've been committing admin aside, diplo side, military side. We've just we've just been destroying our monarch power. Um, give me. I don't care. I'll take that. Let's probably we should probably pay this corruption down a little more. Let's go ahead and just root it, put it to there. We're still making twenty three ducats a month doing that, which is fine. Um, damn, I really don't want to get rid of any of our leaders right now, especially this guy. He's got two siege. We just don't have any power projection is the thing. Hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure, actually. You know what? Let's see. Can we hire a better... I don't like getting six military points a month. I guess we do have to get rid of this guy as much as I want to keep him. Yeah. For now, I suppose that's probably our best course of action. Oh, well. What can we do? Not a lot. Not a lot at this point. Ming wants Diplo now. I'm so tired of Ming. I am very ready for the point where we can just smack Ming down and annihilate him. That time is very, very close, actually. That time is very close. Probably once we finish consolidating, like, in this area. Once we could take Archon Pegu and, uh... Because what I want to do with our war against Ayu is I want to take all of this in one war. And I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to, just looking at the dev through here. It's, I mean, there is a decent bit, don't get me wrong, but it's definitely lower than, say, like, this area of his country. Pegu is 31 dev, that's pretty ridiculous. I'm still, mi I'm still kind of mind blown by how much dev bombing the AI does so often. It's amazing when you conquer it. <laughs> It is absolutely amazing when you conquer it. Okay, so barracks, nah. Is there really anything we can build? Um, let's build a marketplace in Bugloss, actually. I'm fine with this. Oh, one more. One more. One more point of development, and we will have ourselves printing press spawned all the way out here in Southeast Asia. Wait for it. Ta-da! We did it. Yay. The nobility need land. Okay, that's fine. Um, nobility, nobility, nobility. What do you get? You get no one gets this land. This is mine. I am keeping it forever. <laughs> no one will ever see get that land. No estates will ever get it. Um Hmm. We're kinda running out of uh we have God, we have so much good dev in this area that is we're kinda running out of places to uh give our estates that aren't going to affect the economy too much. You know what? Let's just give them Jesselton. That's fine for now. It is a 12 dev province, but it has foreign manpower, so I'm definitely not opposed to that by any means. And on that note, guys, we are going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode of Rise of the Philippine Tigers. So as always, I want to thank you for tuning in, spending a little part of your day here. It is greatly appreciated. If you guys are enjoying the series, please do remember to drop a like down below as it really helps the channel out and subscribe for more Grand Strategy content in the future. My name is Ori. I hope you guys have a fantastic day, and we'll catch you in the next one.